Thank you for the third part of the series. If you want to get more into herbs, please consult a professional or read a book about herbs. So this is uh, a okay. mugwort. Yeah. This is a plant that the native of the land that was here in Miami <laughs> is still here. They use this to put in their shoes for walking and stuff like that. It's also a nerve tonic. It's bitter. Does it smell? Uh, walking, yeah, for sprains, fatigue. Uh, fatigue, stress. Now, where did you get? You don't buy these at the store, do you? No, that's why I'm telling you, say, Mr. Yeah, Alfred. A secret Jamaican place. These are plants that grow here. I know this plant since I got here. I read it in book, but get to oh, see it for yourself. Oh, they're indigenous to South Florida. You could say that, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Any pastures, 500 yards away from your home, there's an open land with some food there. But people them don't know that, and that's Daisy over there. That's the same now rabbit how, feed. How do you? Let, let's say you harvest the plant. How do you keep them fresh? Do you put them in the refrigerator, or? No, it, plants have feelings too, you know. So. <laughs> So when you say my put, that's why I keep saying seep. You know, you have to, before you harvest them, reason with them. They, they have ears too, they have vibes, they have energy. If right. we can love animals to pet and walk them, we can love plants. Not just to have them on your, like, decoration, but more so. So for, it's like a spiritual nature. Every, every plant has its own spirit. And energy say. and vibration, because that's all it is, energy and vibration. Yeah. Have that type of vibration that can come up on its own. You don't have to plant it. We call it shrubs and weed. And they will poison the, 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 the soil. So you go through the spiritual aspect of the plant. You have to have that. You can't have that without that. Yeah. Interesting. That's a whole new outlook on it. Uh, yeah. Everybody think a plant is a... Uh, manufactured entity, you know? Yeah, because you have some plant that's a man made, but that's another lecture. That's yeah, that's the manufactured <laughs> one. Yeah. Uh, uh, you know? So. Yeah, you know, what's the other benef benefits? People want to be, you know, there's another periwinkle. Yeah, I'm not showing you the ones them for, for the eye, you know, because, yeah. So come forward now, I will show you another one. I don't know if Sister Sophia to tell you. But this is the blessed, this is another form of, um, what do you call that now? Oh, um, it looks like a bromeliad, but it isn't. No, this is another form of leaf of life. Remember we tell you about life leaf? Yeah, 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 uh, yeah. Yeah, this is another form. You notice the leaf, them shape, a kind of, um, what them call it, sagittal. And that's oh, okay. called blessed thistle. It's a form of thistle family. You know, you have the other thistle, milk thistle right, and all right. that. But this is a blessed thistle, and that's good for nerves, the brain, and of course digestion too. But at the end of these plants, you have a little prickle on it. It's ah. also family to the, um, what do you call that now? The dandelion. <coughs> oh, okay. You Especially dandelion family that. too. But the, the one, that, this one now. If you can zoom in, come all the way around so you can zoom in on this one. That one is from the dandelion family directly. But if you notice, it have the same little pricks on the sides, oh, like okay. that one. And these plants grow without we. Um, if you look in between the part where they, you can even walk good, you can walk on some oh, of yeah. them. They're pretty prolific. They kind of spread. Yeah. They don't clump. They're not clumpers. No. So... They will come in little clusters, but that's for them, you know what I mean? But these plants now are not plants you can find. Uh, you find them in the pharmacy, but you won't find people having them, much people having. You go ahead. Everybody has that ugly, ugly brain. And this is the broom weed now. And you know broom sweep clean, right? Broom weed. What does that Broom weed. What's yeah, what's that is us. Buy a build a body. Build your body? Yeah. What do you mean build your body? It's like if you clean you out. And if you have, you know, venereal disease and stuff like that, chronic sickness. Oh, that's, that, that's the total, total body works, you know. It's like the Chinese. They got like 3,000 different herbs and stuff. We got it too. Yeah. yeah. Jamaicans got it. We call it ironweed too. a whole new different outlook on, 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 on uh, 
plants and stuff. It's a whole new thing. Well, sometimes they come and learn it from us, you know. Most of the time they come learn and get degrees and they never come back, but they get it from us, so. So this one now is called Fresh Cut. It's another Jamaican plant again, but I don't think it's just indigenous to Jamaica. It is um, in South Florida. Cause I, you so know, if any, anybody who gets sick, they come to your house and they just say, Hey, fix me up here. I got a cold. No, they don't have to be sick. <laughs> Sickness is a state of mind. <laughs> so, so, so this is fresh cut. That's for cold, flus, asthma, and stuff like that. Wow. Clean out the lungs. This is a, uh, you know, we call it, they call it Spanish basil. Right. Spanish yeah, the basil thyme. Yeah. But we call it Ethiopian thyme, African thyme, you our thyme. spaghetti sauce. Or, well, yeah. the Americans put it in spaghetti sauce. Yeah, or stuff yeah. Like that. Yeah, that's what they do. The but this is the giant now. It's another Jamaican pepper plant area. again. Pepper elder in their world, uh, in this world. It's good for joint pains, rheumatism, arthritis. And yeah, stuff I can like see that. you don't have that too much bug uh, infestation because I Be guess because we have plants in here, which is another lecture again, <laughs> that runs away the bugs. Exactly. The, the bugs yeah, feed yeah. on those yeah. and don't mess with that. It's like a camouflage. I'm talking about the, the reason with each other. That's why they can't in harmony right. too. As as One like protects the other. Right. One from them. Yeah. yeah. Now, we're growing them in that way, and as we learn, we go along, you know what I mean? We don't know everything, but we know some things. And then that's the, the length that, that, um, you know, this, right here? this is the same um, relative to the dandelion. It's a part of the Tissot family. I, won't, I don't know the name exactly, but we keep them and use them. We see them in books, so that's why we know some of them. Ah, oh, okay. And they, these things just grow every time it reaches this time. Every time, I think they're what? Right. Spring. Spring, yeah, spring plants. So you see them come up in the spring. If you see them in your place, don't chop them out. Don't cut them out. I'll call the, you then. Hey, pick them up. That's <laughs> yeah, all right. No problem. Well, no. What does that do? Now, what does that do? That is basically doing the same thing like with the milk thistle, radiation. People who use computers, cell phone. It, 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 these things mess up the liver. Yeah, I can believe that. And as my partner tell me, it is um, also... Um, salad, if it's younger, you can eat it. Yeah, in, in the younger state. Like how it's still like that, the pricks is not on it. The first one that I show you. Yeah. Yeah, it, the, the prickle is not on it. That, you know. It's another, another one there. If you zoom over. See it? In between the stall one here. Yeah, yeah. I, I get kind of lazy and I, get, I don't want to drink coffee all the time. Do you have like an energy plant? Yeah, man. We talk about all of them. Dandelion. This is a dandelion. You, you ever see these plants in you know, the, the pastures and the people's house? And they just cut them out. Look how beautiful this is. This is a farmer dandelion. You don't have to buy it. So how do you eat that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We eat that raw, you know. It just comes up now? Yeah. To mother nature, you know. We keep them before we even know the name. Right. Because, you know, you have to Intuitive, yeah. Yeah. You got it. Like you ingest certain things. It is better, sorry. It is better to ingest these plants and figure them out. I'm not telling everybody to go out there and go do that because you know people will come and talk about and then them talk about disclaimer. So let's you say this disclaimer they now. consult the doctor before they... No, the doctor don't know nothing about this. That's I mean, true. That they don't know. Doctors don't That's know not a disclaimer. About it's no. about pills. It's about pills and yeah. it's a business. So yeah, yeah. this, I'm saying, is if it looks like a lettuce, then it must be a lettuce. We have a lot of lettuce like that. Now, how let's say, let's say a guy who's introduced to, to spices like I am, who do they go to? Who do they go to to, to learn, you know, to... To take, you know, if they have an ailment, who do they go to? Well, the first thing they do, try and figure out, go into the Bible and read the healing of a nation, Genesis. I don't remember the chapter, but if we read the Bible, and most of us grow up on Bible, love the Bible so much that we won't part from it, but we won't follow the instruction of the Bible. You understand? We follow the instruction to eat meat, but we don't know what time period that was, so we follow that up. 
But these plants don't do you anything, they don't hurt you. Right. Yeah. Nature produces poison, but it has its antidote or cure. Ah, but I see a, what you mean. But we have a wrap now. So listen to the sister and then we can reason right. again. Because we basically cover everything. You know about that already. Yeah, aloe. The yeah. yeah, aloe, yeah. 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 Wandering Jew. Wandering Jew, the car. Prostate. prostate again. Wandering Jew. That's the this one, you see it? That's the, the one, purple. That's from the Bahamas. And also all colors. Over so all over do, the place. What do you do with those? You eat? How, no, make, a, make, a sip make, make a, a sip. Yeah, tea. You can juice it because it's soft. And what is that supposed to do? That's good for your digestion, your nerve, the colors. So the next time you come back, we we'll do uh, another well, one. My, on my kidneys will be overdrive coming. Thank you for Sophie and Rasta Woody for this delightful information and visiting their great garden on this exciting video. And we'll see you next time. Alfred's Gardening World.